Defense experts around the world are calling it the most shocking development in military aviation this decade. In June 2025, Lockheed Martin dropped a bombshell announcement that sent shockwaves through the Pentagon and left even seasoned military analysts stunned. The aerospace giant revealed what they're calling the most aggressive upgrade in the F-35's entire history, a complete transformation that's turning heads from Washington to allied nations worldwide. Welcome to Jet Insight. But here's what really caught everyone off guard. This isn't just another routine software update or minor hardware refresh. We're talking about a revolutionary leap that incorporates sixth-generation fighter technologies, originally developed for America's most classified next-generation air dominance program. After losing the NGAD contract to Boeing in March 2025, the Air Force is going to be awarding the contract for the next-generation air dominance platform to Boeing. Lockheed Martin made a bold decision that stunned the defense community. Instead of accepting defeat, they're taking every cutting-edge technology they developed for that futuristic fighter and cramming it into the F-35. The numbers alone are staggering. CEO Jim Takele made a claim that left defense analysts scrambling to verify the math. He stated they can deliver 80% of the F-47's capability at 50% of the cost. That's not just impressive, it's game-changing. When you consider that the new F-47 is expected to cost around $300 million per aircraft, suddenly an upgraded F-35 at $150 million starts looking like the deal of the century. If you're as amazed by this military breakthrough as we are, type PROUD in the comments below and let us know what you think about America's latest fighter advantage. What makes this even more remarkable is the timeline. As of June 2025, Lockheed Martin has already delivered 200 F-35s equipped with the new Technology Refresh 3 configuration. These aren't prototypes or test aircraft. These are production models rolling off the assembly line in Fort Worth, Texas at a rate of 20 aircraft per month. The company expects to deliver between 170 and 190 F-35s throughout 2025, and they're not slowing down. But the real story starts in the high security briefing rooms where this transformation was born. After Boeing's surprise victory in the next generation air dominance competition, many expected Lockheed Martin to fade quietly into the background. Instead, they did something unprecedented in the defense industry. They took every advanced technology, every breakthrough innovation, every classified capability they had developed for their NGAD bid and decided to retrofit it into America's most successful fifth generation fighter. The scope of this upgrade is mind blowing. We're talking about 75 new programs spanning three major categories. First, dramatically improved sensors that can detect threats at unprecedented ranges. Second, the ability to carry more and different types of weapons than ever before. And third, revolutionary computing systems with open source architecture that will future-proof the aircraft for decades to come. The heart of this transformation lies in what Lockheed calls Technology Refresh 3, or TR-3. Think of it as giving the F-35 a complete brain transplant. The new integrated core processor delivers computing power that makes the previous system look like a calculator compared to a supercomputer. The enhanced panoramic cockpit display gives pilots situational awareness that was pure science fiction just five years ago. And the expanded memory unit can process and store data at speeds that would make your home computer weep with envy. What's truly revolutionary is the open mission systems architecture. This isn't just an upgrade. It's a complete reimagining of how military aircraft integrate new capabilities. The modular design means future enhancements can be added without the massive overhauls that traditionally plagued military programs. It's like having a smartphone that can upgrade its hardware, not just its apps. The weapons integration is where things get seriously impressive. The F-35 can now carry the entire AGM-158 cruise missile family, including the fearsome long-range anti-ship missile that can strike targets over 500 miles away. But here's the kicker. They've developed something called the Sidekick Rack that allows the aircraft to carry six AMRAM-sized missiles internally. That's double the previous internal load, while maintaining the stealth signature that makes the F-35 invisible to enemy radar. 
In February 2024, test pilots conducted the first successful integration of the AGM-158C long-range anti-ship missile on an F-35B. The results exceeded all expectations. The aircraft maintained its stealth characteristics while carrying a weapon that can sink the largest enemy warships from distances that keep our pilots completely safe from retaliation. The electronic warfare capabilities represent perhaps the most classified aspect of this upgrade. What we can tell you is that the new systems can not only detect enemy communications and radar signals, but can actively disrupt them in ways that previous generations of aircraft simply couldn't achieve. It's like giving the F-35 the ability to blind and confuse enemy defenses while remaining completely invisible itself. But the real game-changer is the networking capability. The upgraded F-35 doesn't fight alone. It fights as part of a connected battle network that shares information instantaneously across all friendly forces. In a successful test conducted with the Danish Ministry of Defense, F-35 SS transmitted classified data from Fort Worth, Texas all the way to Skrydstrup Air Base in Denmark through commercial satellite links. The implications are staggering. Every F-35 becomes a node in a global information network that gives American and allied forces unprecedented battlefield awareness. The stealth improvements go far beyond what most people understand. Lockheed has developed new low observable coatings that make the aircraft even harder to detect on both radar and infrared sensors. They've redesigned engine inlets and outlets to reduce the aircraft's heat signature. The result is an F-35 that's not just stealthier than before, but stealthier than anything else flying today. Here's where it gets really interesting. Lockheed Martin has hinted at something they're calling pilot optional capability. While they haven't revealed all the details, this suggests the upgraded F-35 could potentially operate autonomously when needed. The advanced manned-unmanned teaming capability allows a single F-35 pilot to control multiple drone wingmen, effectively multiplying the combat power of each aircraft. The international response has been overwhelming. Greece signed an agreement in July 2024 for 20 F-35, as with an option for 20 more. The Czech Republic committed to 24 aircraft in January 2024. Romania, Poland, and Belgium have all placed orders recognizing that this upgraded F-35 represents the future of air combat. What makes this particularly impressive is how Lockheed Martin turned adversity into advantage. The TR-3 program faced significant challenges, including a delivery suspension that lasted from mid-2023 to mid-2024. During this period, the Pentagon withheld $5 million per aircraft and Lockheed Martin forfeited $60 million in fees. Instead of cutting corners, they invested 700 million of their own money to sustain production and avoid supply chain disruptions. The European industrial contribution showcases the global nature of this program. Rheinmetall in Germany produces center fuselages. Patria in Finland manufactures forward fuselages. Leonardo in Italy builds wings. And Belgian suppliers produce horizontal tail sections. This isn't just an American program. It's a testament to allied cooperation and shared commitment to maintaining air superiority. The testing phase has been equally impressive. The first flight test of a TR-3 configured F-35 took place on January 6, 2023, from Edwards Air Force Base in California. During the 50-minute test flight, the aircraft reached 35,000 feet and near supersonic speeds, but more importantly, it demonstrated the rock-solid stability of the new systems under extreme conditions. The Block 4 modernization program represents the full realization of these capabilities. With more than 80 classified and unclassified improvements, it's the most comprehensive fighter upgrade in aviation history. The program includes enhanced sensor suites, additional long-range precision weapons, improved electronic warfare features, more powerful data fusion, and increased cross-platform interoperability. One of the most significant developments is the integration of the GBU-53 Stormbreaker II Glide Bomb, which achieved early operational capability in the second quarter of fiscal year 2025. This precision weapon can engage moving targets in all weather conditions, from standoff ranges that keep our pilots safe from enemy air defenses. The AGM-88 GARGM-ER integration adds another dimension to the F-35's capabilities. This advanced anti-radiation missile can suppress enemy air defenses at ranges that were previously impossible. When combined with the F-35's stealth characteristics, 
It creates a devastating combination that can penetrate the most sophisticated enemy air defense networks. For our military veterans and defense enthusiasts watching today, you understand better than anyone the significance of maintaining technological superiority. If you're part of our military community, whether you served, are currently serving, or simply support our armed forces, we'd love to have you join our growing community of defense professionals who appreciate the dedication and innovation that keeps America safe. The production timeline is equally impressive. Lockheed Martin expects to maintain production at 156 aircraft per year, starting in 2025. The November 2024 preliminary agreement for production. Lots 18 and 19 covers approximately 300 aircraft, ensuring a steady supply of these advanced fighters for both American forces and allied nations. The cost effectiveness of this approach cannot be overstated. Traditional fighter development programs take decades and cost hundreds of billions of dollars. By leveraging existing F-35 production lines and retrofitting sixth generation technologies, Lockheed Martin has created a path to advanced capabilities at a fraction of the traditional cost and timeline. The global fleet implications are staggering. Over 1,100 F-35S have been delivered worldwide, with total production projected to reach 3,500 airframes. The U.S. European Command anticipates that over 700 F-35S will be operating across Europe by 2035, creating an unprecedented level of Allied air power coordination. What sets this program apart is the speed of implementation. Unlike traditional military programs that take decades to mature, some of these sixth generation capabilities could be ready for first flight and integration within two to three years. This rapid timeline is possible because of the modular architecture and the extensive research and development investment that Lockheed Martin has already made. The autonomous capabilities represent perhaps the most revolutionary aspect of this upgrade. While details remain classified, the ability to operate in pilot optional mode could fundamentally change how air combat is conducted. Combined with the collaborative combat aircraft integration, a single F-35 could potentially coordinate with multiple autonomous systems to create overwhelming battlefield advantages. The passive infrared sensor improvements deserve special attention. These systems allow the F-35 to detect enemy aircraft at extended ranges without revealing its own position. As President Trump noted in a White House meeting with Tyclet, Modern air combat isn't about dogfights, it's about shooting the enemy before they even know you're there. These upgraded sensors make that philosophy a reality. The stealth enhancements go beyond traditional radar evading technology. The new low observable materials and geometric modifications make the F-35 harder to detect across the entire electromagnetic spectrum. When combined with the improved electronic warfare capabilities, the result is an aircraft that can operate in contested airspace with near impunity. The international training and deployment programs are expanding rapidly. Poland's first F-35 pilots have begun training at Ebbing Air National Guard Base in Arkansas, while Belgian pilots are training at Luke Air Force Base in Arizona. These programs ensure that Allied forces can maximize the capabilities of their upgraded aircraft while maintaining interoperability with American forces. The retrofit program for existing FF-35S is equally impressive. Lockheed Martin is supplying upgrade kits that can convert earlier TR-2 standard aircraft to the new TR-3 configuration. These kits are being installed at operational bases by contract field teams, ensuring that the entire F-35 fleet can benefit from these revolutionary improvements. The open systems architecture represents a paradigm shift in military aircraft design. Traditional fighters required extensive modifications to integrate new capabilities. The upgraded F-35 can accept new systems and weapons through software updates and modular hardware changes. This approach dramatically reduces costs and timelines for future improvements. The networking capabilities extend far beyond aircraft-to-aircraft -aircraft communication. In demonstrated tests, F-35S have successfully used multi-domain gateways to transfer classified data to command and control systems, which then relayed firing quality information to ground-based rocket artillery units. This level of integration creates a unified battle network that multiplies the effectiveness of all participating systems. The weapon systems integration showcases American innovation at its finest. The internal carriage of six AMRAAM missiles while maintaining stealth characteristics was considered impossible just a few years ago. The sidekick rack system makes this a reality, giving the F-35 unprecedented air-to-air -air combat capability while remaining invisible to enemy radar. 
The Global Production Network demonstrates the strength of allied cooperation, with manufacturing facilities across multiple countries. The F-35 program creates jobs and technological expertise that strengthens the entire alliance. This approach ensures that allied nations have a genuine stake in the program's success while building industrial capabilities that enhance collective security. As we wrap up today's deep dive into this revolutionary fighter upgrade, it's clear that Lockheed Martin hasn't just improved the F-35, they've transformed it into something entirely new. From the sixth generation technologies inherited from the NGAD program to the revolutionary networking capabilities that connect every aircraft in a global battle network, this upgrade represents the future of air combat. The numbers speak for themselves, with over 200 upgraded aircraft already delivered and production ramping up to nearly 200 per year. America and its allies are building an Air Force capability that no adversary can match. The combination of stealth, sensors, weapons, and networking creates a force multiplier effect that ensures air superiority for decades to come. What makes this story even more remarkable is how quickly it's happening. While competitors struggle with prototype development and testing, the upgraded F-35 is already rolling off production lines and entering service with air forces around the world. This speed and efficiency showcase the best of American defense innovation and manufacturing capability. If you've enjoyed learning about this incredible advancement in military technology, we'd appreciate your support. Hit that like button and subscribe to stay updated on the latest developments in defense technology and military innovation. Your engagement helps us continue bringing you the most comprehensive coverage of the technologies that keep America and its allies safe. The future of air combat is here, and it's more impressive than anyone imagined.